Thank you so much. Well, customers of a popular delivery service are complaining about a possible hack. Uh, but first, we got some good grocery deals. It is Wednesday oh, morning, yeah. and Amy Davis is here. Yep, time to check the ads. And if you haven't had time to do it, don't worry. I'll save you some time because I've already checked. Here are the best deals I found this week. If you've got a sprout nearby you, drop in this week to get Honeycrisp apples for $1.48 a pound. And then HEB's meal deal this week will fix your junk food craving. They've got this. Buy two DiGiorno frozen pizzas and get all this stuff for free. A four count package of drumstick ice cream cones, a Dole Caesar salad kit, and an HEB frozen appetizer. That's a whole it's not dinner delivery, party. It's not delivery, it's DiGiorno. Yeah, right. <laughs> and Randall's has large cantaloupes for just 77 cents each. This deal is good for Saturday, Sunday, and Monday only. Hey, dozens of DoorDash customers are complaining. They believe their accounts with the food delivery company were hacked. Many of the customers took to Twitter to let DoorDash know that they've, re they've had fraudulent food deliveries charged to their accounts. They didn't get the food. They say the hack Hackers also changed their email addresses oh so the real customers could not regain access to their account. Customers say DoorDash never responded to their concerns, and DoorDash says there has been no data breach, but that the culprit was likely credential stuffing. They say that's when hackers take lists of stolen usernames and passwords and try them on other sites that may use the uh, same credentials. That is why they say don't use the same password there you go. everywhere. Hey, if you love Nutella, Listen up, look at your screen. This new oh, candy no. may just be for you. It's M&M's, they've announced two new products, including the new hazelnut spread flavor of the chocolate candies. The new flavor will be available in April 2019. We've got to wait a little bit. A little bit. If that wasn't enough, though, the company's also launching M&M chocolate bars in five flavors. I like this idea. Peanut, milk, chocolate, crispy almond, and crispy mint. Those will be in stores in December in time for uh, Christmas stocking stuffers. I, I like it in theory. You never, you never know until you open the package and take a bite. But in yeah, theory, a lot of it. It's like the Oreo mashup. It's like, why? I don't know. <laughs> it needs to taste like Fruity Pebbles. It might be over, overkill. It's a classic. Yeah, right. <laughs> Thanks, Amy.